almighty. Sadly, we are once again standing across from the United Nations. We are here once again to plead, to appeal to the leaders of the world. How can we stand by silently? Janine, Janine, Janine once again, an attack. Every day we hear of some Palestinian child being murdered. And then, if that's not enough, they have the chutzpah, the hubris, the audacity to attack a whole city. They see the world is silent. So they come in and they go, a whole refugee camp and a whole city that since it is over 75 years, they're living in squalor. And the world is silent, continually silent. Why? This is being done in the name of a religion, of my religion, of Judaism, and the world is duped. They justify what they're doing because they say this is a religious conflict and the ones that oppose them are anti-Semitic. How revolting, how false. That's not only a lie, it's evil. That's right, yeah. Yeah. that's right. It's evil to its core. Every really religious community living around the world from South America to the UK to me, Sharim, in our courts in Jerusalem will tell you that because we are Jews, we oppose the occupation. Right. Because we are Jews, we demand the freedom of Palestine in its entirety. <laughs> this is not Jewish. This is anti-God. This is anti-religion. This is anti-everything holy. My religion says do not kill, do not steal. My religion says it's forbidden to occupy. As Jewish people, we have been living together with Muslims, with every type of Arab and Muslim people for hundreds of years. As brothers and sisters, we've lived together. Yes, we have distinctly different religions, but this never was an impediment or any way of disturbing our peaceful coexistence. In fact, we were protected. In fact, we were embraced when we were being tortured and burnt in Europe. It was the Muslim and Arab countries that took us in. And now Janine is burning. And these Zionists are claiming it's because they're protecting the Jews from their enemies. How revolting! Revolting. That's not true! It's not true! We were living together in every corner of the Arab land and throughout Palestine. We were living in peace in the same courtyards without any human rights, without the existence of the United Nations. What changed? One thing changed. This new neighbor, Zionism, and all the people who support it, that's what changed, not the religion Judaism. These people don't represent religion. They are a simple, selfish, flawed, political, nationalist group, sometimes garbed or masquerading in my religion, and sometimes, or more usually not, but they are not Judaism. They don't represent the religion, and they don't represent the Jews who are following the religion. This is unacceptable to its core. People are dying in Janine. People are dying in Gaza. People are dying in refugee camps spread out throughout the world and because they're in squalor with painted water with food that is spoiled without any proper clothing without any proper education and the world is silent 
the world that's constantly talking about helping people who are suffering. Yet Palestine, who's for well over 75 years, is dying. We dare not be silent. We plead with the world to respect Jews who are true to their religion, just as you will respect the leaders of another religion to espouse their religion. Hear our voice and stop supporting a totally illegal occupation. Every day another Palestinian dies. Every day children grow up maimed, psychologically damaged, emotionally murdered. We dare not be silent. We want you to know it is clear in our Torah that we are forbidden to steal. It is clear we are forbidden to have this concept of the state of Israel, even one inch. It is clear that we are required to stand up and tell the world that this state is not Judaism, that this state must end. Please let us stand together and, and speak clearly. Not a war between religions, not a war between Jews and Muslims. This is nothing to do with religious conflict, and you are not anti-Semitic by opposing the occupation. On the contrary, this state exacerbates and creates hate and anti-Semitism and a rift between Jews and others. Let us stand, speak up, and tell the world we will not be silent till inshallah there will be not only a free, a free Janine, not only a free Walid, but a free Palestine. Inshallah. We will continue and God help. You should hear our prayers and our standing on the streets. And we should accomplish that God with his compassion should bring this soon in our days. And ultimately the day when, as it says on the list wall behind us, and from Isaiah, that they shall really beat their swords into plowshares, their spears into pruning hooks. One nation shall not lift up a sword against another nation, nor there shall war learn war anymore. We should have peace with the revelation of God that we can serve them in harmony together. Amen. Thank you. Judaism, yes. Zionism, no. The state Judaism, of Israel yes. must go. Judaism, yes. Zionism, no. The state of Israel must go. Judaism, yes.